Hey guys, this is Nasim here, and welcome back to Guardian Guides, where I break down all the patterns and teach you how to dodge them. Today's guest is Lumaris, and this Guardian is designed to help you learn back attacks, so a lot of his safe zones are right behind it. The battle items you want to bring with you are HP potions, a flare, or a pheromone bomb. Like any Guardian raid, you should start with using your flare to locate the Guardian. This is also a big map, so when Lumeris tries to run away, throwing your pheromone bomb will prevent him from running away. Lumeris will lift his right arm up, then perform a slash. When you see his right arm go up, quickly dodge to his side or stay behind him. If Lumeris glows, he is about to fire his breath. Like the slash, quickly move towards his side or back. If Lumeris glows and jumps, a shock wave will shoot out in a cone shape. Make sure you get to the side when Lumeris glows white. If Lumeris glows blue on the other hand, you can use a counter skill to knock him out for a few seconds. If your counter skill is on cooldown or don't have any, simply walk out of this line. Lumeris will do a child yoga pose before he uses this. He will punch with his right hand, then his left hand, then use a breath as his combo. Once you see Lumeris go into a child pose, start running in a counterclockwise direction and you should be able to dodge all three attacks. Lumeris lifts both his hands up and slams them on the ground. A few seconds later, multiple geysers will soar from the ground. This is a good time to deal damage. Find a spot where there are no geysers next to Lumeris and deal as much damage as you can. When Lumeris starts shaking his head a few times, that means he is about to use this pattern. There will be three shockwaves coming out, but this is easily dodged by staying right behind him. If you see Lumera shake his head like this, start positioning yourself towards his... <clears throat> you know where. This doesn't really damage you, but he usually combos right after it. So just be aware of his next pattern. After Lumeris runs away, he will start to use two more patterns. This one is just a combo of the 1-2 breath and the geyser patterns. By the end of the 1-2 breath pattern, geysers will start soaring. If Lumeris does not glow and hops, he will go into a charging motion. After this charge is finished, there will be a shockwave covering 300 degrees around him. The safe zone is, of course, you know where. I hope this video helped you master Lumeris, and I hope to see you in the next episode of Guardian Guides. Alright, peace. I need to know if you'll give me a second chance. But don't come on often, but please, you know I can't stand it when you don't talk to me.